broken history. Aye, not exactly an easy fix for that. I see the elves continue their war. Yeah. So much for things being better in Alpha. <laughs> Yikes. Thimble Winter hit Alfheim hard. No. Storms have plagued Alfheim's deserts long before Thimble Winter. Living desert. Huh. It was once full of life, you know. And music. The song of the sands, he called it. Gone now. Another victim of war. <laughs> I hear something out there. Something big. It's in pain. What do you hear? Feels like some kind of animal. How could anything live in a storm like that? Plenty of caves under the desert. Not exactly a paragon of comfort, but... The Dark Elves get on best they can. Perhaps we can reach that brazier from above. There, the Temple of Light. Groa's shrine is at the top. Good eye. Bifrost eyes. Is everything okay? Hi, old friend. Just looting no one your chests. We'll be right along. My dad likes loot. Uh, very well. <laughs> Freyr never bothered returning to Alfheim, did he, Mimir? Aye, no. I assumed the fate of his own realm took precedence. Wait. 
Freya's brother? Yes. Cut from a different cloth, that one. There's a barricade up ahead. Oh. Didn't know I could do that. Oh. Very clever. Lyricism from the mind of Gvasia. Freya's brother. How was he involved? Long ago, Freya of the Vanir traveled to Alfheim, where he discovered a once beautiful land devastated by war. <clears throat> Using his divine powers, he set about cultivating a tenuous peace among the elves. Did you mention how that peace fell apart as soon as he left? I was getting to it. You hear that? Oh, no. That's enough, please. You don't need to do this. We don't want to hurt you. We do not have a choice. Attacked us. 
More will follow once we're inside. Is there truly no other way? Not like they're giving us much of a choice. So your father said. I'm just naive, I suppose. No. Just an optimist, old friend. So tall. We came in from the top last time. I didn't realize all this was even down here. It's an older gate, built to promote cooperation between the elves. But it looks like it's been sealed for some time. How do we enter? Grab that wheel and I'll show you. A tribute to Freyr, made by the elves. He must have left it here when he raced back to Vanaheim. What is this? A ch to ward off nightmares. In this case, flares. Well, knowing the elves, there are probably more tributes to find. I'll go first. Petraeus, let me know when I've reached halfway. So, uh, what's happening right now? This seal is meant to represent the balance of the realm when Freyr was here. Light and dark, working together in harmony. How's that look, Atreus? Good, I think. Father. Unfortunately for Alfheim, Freyr couldn't accept his sister's decision to marry Odin. He returned to Vanaheim and left this realm to its fate. To be fair, the Aesir did set him on fire that one time. Hmm. The door should have opened. Are you sure it's balanced? Yeah, but the realm isn't. Not anymore. Father, try pulling it the other way. Yeah, yeah! And here, you keep pushing forward. Fine work, Atreus. Shall we? What's a Dark Elf statue doing in the Light Temple? That's just how they looked before the division. The division. Yes. The elves weren't always split between light and dark, you know. This statue depicts the elves before the war, before they discovered the power of the light. Yes. The stone briefly imparts a bit of light to your axe. That's useful. What's that sound? No sense in spoiling the surprise. Oh, it's the light. Uh, uh, ow. I've never seen the Lake of Souls so volatile. Aye. Fimple winter, you reckon? Of course. Making the light unstable. So the base of this light well, that's the Lake of Souls. Yes. After the creation of the Nine Realms, fallen souls began to gather down in those waters. When the elves discovered its potential, they built this temple to harness that energy. A smashing success, to say the least. Many of them became addicted to their newfound power, and thus the Light Elves were born.
Maybe a different angle? Well done. Though I imagine our Light Elf friends will be less than pleased. Speaking of Light Elves, let me try talking to them. Again. They Thanks may just to let these two do their thing, brother. Light Bomb, watch out! on light bridges, but now the bridges are gone. I have an idea to get us across. <laughs> Lucky for us, swearing off violence doesn't mean we can't disfigure some architecture. This way, the shrine away. Just looking around. He does this sometimes. Ah, are you smiling? Carry on. Temple looks so different than I remember. It was all broken and covered in hive stuff last time we were here. These owls use Alpine's light to enhance the temple and themselves by the way. They definitely look more dangerous than last time. Oh, those were just the foot soldiers. They'll get more dangerous the further up we go. Great. The shrine is this way, Kratos. Yeah, he knows. Like to be By all means. Oh, I felt that oh. one. Oh. 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 They smell oh. off. The oh. bastards about to explode.
How do we explore it? Shall we continue? So if these elves use the light to build doors and make themselves stronger, what do the Dark Elves want with it? To return it back to its source. To them, the natural resources of Alfheim are sacred, none more so than the light itself. Aye, the light elf's success came at a terrible price. Alfheim's once lively desert withered into a storm-ridden wasteland soon after the creation of this temple. There's more Twilight Stone up there. Perhaps a higher vantage point is needed. What became of Kavasir? Ripped apart by his audience. Well, one member of his audience. Well, Thor. Elves ahead. I'll handle this. Uh, maybe that's not a great idea. Oh, there, friends. Salutations. We mean you no harm. Here, get back. Oh. At least 
why they keep fighting. The Dark Elves want the souls and the light left alone. The Light Elves want to keep using them. That's the long and short of it. Aye. So then, which side is right? Rarely is it so simple. And not our place to say. This is an elven conflict. I said as much the last time we were in Alfheim. Right. They sure made a lot of these light doors. Mm. Fortifications. Aye. None too eager to let the Dark Elves run the roost again. looks right. Excellent. Let's continue our ascent, yes? <laughs> I don't think that's the way up to the shrine. We know. There's a chest over here. Oh, I see it now. Forgive my impatience. Oh, tricky. There's gotta be a way to get your axe behind the spray, right? I don't mean to speak out of turn, but the white marble wall behind that grate. Perhaps your axe can reach it. Back to it then. <laughs> There's always meaning if you look hard enough, brother. It's all in what you bring to it. 